Bum, 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 bum. I don't remember where Ricky's is at now that I think about it, actually, which is bad, because that means I don't know how to get to it, but I know where Charlotte's is. It's at the Central Plaza. Where was Ricky's? I might have to look it up. I don't remember. I know it's in Frontier Village, but I'm not sure where, and I'm not sure what time the person that gives it spawns. Also, the person that gives Charlotte's is supposed to be standing right here, but it must not be the right time. So I'm going to have to change spawn time here, too. Let me make sure that this message isn't anything important. Stop making noise, phone. Why is my phone so loud? There we go. Are you kidding me? It's something stupid. Okay. Let me switch times around until we find what we need. Oh, right there. I think that's her. Uh, Rasha. Yeah, this should be it. Uh, do you mind if I talk to you about something? Of course, if you think I can help. Uh, once I used to travel the world as an Opon merchant. My sister Pond and I ran our own little outfit. It was so enjoyable. Then one night we were attacked as we set up camp by Aerith Sea. Uh, I was badly injured, and my sister Pond lost her life. Oh, that's unfortunate. How awful. I'm so sorry to hear that. My sister Pond was Cherry's Mama Pond. Since then, I have been taking care of Cherry. But she blames me for her Mama Pond's death. Ah, oh, that's just dumb. Time is supposed to be a great healer. But maybe Cherry doesn't want to accept what happened that day. Even though she knows it was just an accident. I know better than anyone that it's hard to accept these things. Perhaps you're right. But still, I wish it had been me who died that day. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And not my sister Pond. A little dramatic here. You can't think like that, Rasha. But maybe, yes, here's an idea. Let's go back in time and switch your scenarios. <laughs> Tell me, do you know what kind of monster attacked you? Uh, it was near the Aether Crystal deposit at Aerith Sea. It's probably still there even now. Of course it is. Maybe we could get rid of it. I know that won't change anything between you and Sherry, but you and Sherry need to find some way of getting over this. Her stubbornness is to stop sometime. If you would beat that monster, it would be a great help. All right, so we got to defeat the Pillager Ho uh, Hode. I almost said hold. Pillager Hode in the area of the Aether Crystal Deposit at Aerith Sea. Easy enough. Take care. Except we're going to have to play as Sharla. You can count on us. We'll get it done. Uh, we can do it. We can do it. It may not be easy, but with you, I feel inspired. Uh, you taught me the importance of seeing things through. All right. I'm pretty sure that I could just switch to Dunman or Shulk since I've already finished accepting the quest. I just have to accept and finish it as Sharla. But that, that kind of takes away from the whole skill tree thing, doesn't it? In my opinion. I have this whole map finished. Cool. I don't remember when I did that. I must have done it when I was uh, doing quests last time. Because I remember there were a few black spots here that I hadn't filled out yet. But apparently I did. Uh, where is the... There it is. Closest way to get there is going to be from the lighthouse. Almost 20 minutes in and we've not gotten much done. We finished that defending quest. We finished one of the skill tree quests, which didn't take long at all. And now we're working on the... Hi? This chest just fell on my head. I have no idea what just happened there, but okay. But awesome. Let's go. I want to get at least a little bit of progress done in the... Uh, back in Maconis Field. And to be able to do that, we've got to uh, finish up all these skill trees. Well, I could go do it right now if I wanted, but I want to get the skill trees done first. Especially since Sharla, Shulk, and Ryan all... Ryan's got his now, but they all really needed it. Like, Ricky isn't in dire need of getting his, but Sharla, Ryan, and Shulk are all almost done with their original skill trees. So they... Unless they want to just waste skill points by not being able to put it towards anything, then they have to have another skill tree unlocked. We're not going to be getting the fifth skill trees until post-game, by the way, regardless of how much SP it makes me lose, because I looked most of them up to see how you got them, and they all had warnings saying, hey, you've got to fight, like, level 90 enemies during this. So, yeah, we're not going to be capable. We probably won't even get those done. I'll try and get them done before the game is over, but it'll involve a lot of off-screen SP grinding, I bet. Because... You know, we'll be doing it in the post game. There's not going to be much to do in the post game other than get the last of the skill trees and do the uh, super bosses. And uh, we have to. There is uh, that last chain of giant quests that I want to do on uh, in the post game because you also have to fight level 90 enemies in that. Where is this Hode Pillager? He's not down there, is he? Is that does that count as the? Ether deposit area? Or is that like Anu Shore or something? No, it counts as the crystal deposit. He could be down there. Huh. It's also possible that if he spawns outside of the quest, which doesn't normally huh. happen uh, for quests like this. Normally, the only time that they can spawn outside of quests 
is when it's a quest that specific the challenge quests where it specifically says hey kill this enemy this one was like huh. an added on quest so normally that means that the monster doesn't show up until you've accepted it let's jump down there and see if it's down there because there's literally nothing here why would the nopon have been all the way down there though that's my question it's got to be here rather than up there i thought yeah i can see some hoes right there i think looks like it oh there are plenty of hoes down here yeah uh, Unai, Archer, Unai. What's this one? Pillager? Yep, this is it. Pillager Hode. It's not even like a unique enemy. Let everyone heal up a little bit after the fall, and then we're going to tear this thing apart. It's only level 35. This is going to be easy. Let's go. Let's I don't even need full health. Did you see that, like, side shot that Charla just did? That was really weird. I guess I'll shield bullet, uh, Fiora. Just, just kill this thing. Just kill it, please. I don't, I don't want to play as Charla. I'm so bad as Charla. I'm just gonna cast heal around, why not? Easy. I got some kind of a key item that said cloth something. I pressed A too fast to see it. I was thinking like, oh, this is just something that Ricky stole off of it, except, you know, Ricky's not in the party right now. Let's go back to Frontier Village and talk to uh, Rasha. Let her know that the deed has been done. And then hopefully that's all there is to the skill tree. We can move on to uh, Ricky's next. I have to look that up where Ricky's is. Is Rasha still right over here? She looked like she was walking away before. Yeah, she's walked off somewhere. And I don't know where to. Let me just take time back by like an hour or two. She's normally just like standing right here next to the thing. Oh, is that her in the center? I think that's her in the center. I thought she stood on the side. Maybe she does stand in the center. Are you Rasha? No, Migaga. Where is Rasha at? Up here? Where are you at, Rasha? I got good news for you. Where'd you go? Well, this is annoying. What's my current quest thing? It's to go back to Rasha, right? Do -do. Uh, return to Rasha, yeah. Where is she? She should also be showing up on the mini-map with a little red uh, exclamation point. Go forward one more hour. Huh. Nothing? Still nothing. Let's just change time drastically to morning. There we go. Uh, you got rid of the monster. What saved me back then was my sister Pond's sacrifice. She drew away the monster's attention. That allowed me to escape despite my injuries. Uh, but Sherry still feels I abandoned my sister Pond that day. Can I make one final request? It is about a piece of cloth that belonged to my sister pond. Oh, hey, that's probably what I picked up. Can you give it to Sherry for me? Where is Sherry? How am I supposed to find her? The cloth shred to Sherry, but where is Sherry? Game, why do you do this to me? I have no idea where this person's at. Okay, you know what? Hold up. I, I need to figure out where Ricky's mission is. I'm going to Google it really quick with my phone. And then we can also Google where Sherry is. Because Google is great. Ricky, fourth skill tree. Spelt fourth wrong because of my phone, but it understood and spell checked the whole thing for me. Uh, it can be unlocked by completing the quest getting bigger. I'm pretty sure I've done so. Now, where, where is the quest, however? Where do I get it? This is just telling me the skill tree. I don't need to know the skill tree. I need to know what quest gives me said skill tree. Okay, wait a minute. This isn't telling me what I need to know. Here we go. Ricky's skill trees. This should tell me what quest and where to get them. If it loads. Uh, da 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 da. Skill tree is called cowardice. Yada yada. Oh, this took me back to the same thing. Oh, wait. Here we go. Here we go. It can be unlocked by completing the quest. You don't have to get the quest done beforehand. You have to complete getting bigger. Okay, I misunderstood. I read it wrong. Where is this quest located? Go away, you stupid advertisement. It is at the chief's residence from 18 to 3. All right, cool. Now, where is Sherry? Is the only other thing I need to know. Xenoblade Chronicles. If I just put in the name, you spelt like this, right? Almost spells Sheria from uh, Tales of Graces. 6 to 18, 
at Paul and Orb's storehouse. All right, cool. I know where to go. Going up to the Paul and Orb's storehouse. What's the quickest way there? I think the archaeology level is. Uh, no, storehouse. Here it is, Paul and Orb's storehouse. So, uh, just climb from here, honestly, rather than try and fast travel anywhere. Let's go. It should be 6 to 18 right now. I'm pretty sure I fast traveled to, like, 9 in the morning or something. So let's get up to the Orb storehouse, give this to Sherry. Probably have to go talk back to Rosh after that. Then 18, 18 to 3 at the Chief's residence is where we can get uh, Ricky's quest. And then we just have Shulks after that. Cool. Oh, wait. Right there. Jump down. Jump down. There we go. Sweet. I found you. Uh, this is for you. Piece of old cloth. What would I want with this? You don't recognize it. This pattern. I've seen it somewhere before. It's from my beloved Mama Pond's clothing. No one else would ever wear clothes like this. Where did friends get this? Uh, we avenged your mother's death. So my Auntie Pon Rasha still regrets what happened? Actually, I already knew that. I know it was not Auntie Pon's fault. It was fault of monster. I will never forget, beloved Mama Pon. I will carry this piece of cloth with me always. Uh, never forget. I will never forget those that were dear to me either. Thank you. Uh, from now on, I want to patch things up with my Auntie Pon. Good, I'm glad. I probably have to go talk to Rasha again, so let's just jump down. Should be able to hit the water from here. Oh yeah, definitely. We're good. Sweet. And hopefully she's still right there. Uh, yes, she is. Cool. Awesome. Uh, we delivered it to her. I see. How was she? Uh, she said she doesn't blame you. She knows it was the monster. From now on, she wants to patch things up with you. How nice. Me and Sherry patch things up. I do hope I can be like a good mama pond to her. Uh, you're all she's got, and she's all you've got, right? That's right. I have always wallowed in self-pity about my sister pond's death. What happened to her dad? And what about her grandparents? What happened to all of them? Now I want to put that energy into connecting with Sherry. Uh, if you continue to believe in each other, then it'll turn out fine. I've always believed things would turn out okay. Maybe I was even relying on that idea a bit too much. Thank you so much, my friends. I'll do my best. All right, sweet. This should give us the skill tree for Sharla. Reliance. That's a good one. Uh, we'll look at all of them. We'll look at Sharla, Shulks, and Ricky's once we have all of them. For now, let's just focus on getting the quests done. Go up to the Chief's residence. And I need to switch to Ricky. We're going to do... I'll just keep Ricky and the two girls, honestly. Let's just do that. And then we need... Because Fiora and Melia can get damage done fast. So, that'll work. We need to uh, change the time. 18 to 3. So, let's go with like 20. So, it's a little in the middle. And then I just need to find the person with the exclamation point over their head. Where is the chief's, like, actual house? Because that's where the quest should be at. Chief house is further up, like, in the center, right? Like, up this way? I think so. Is this the chief's house right here? No, this is, like, the mysterious sanctuary or something. This is what I was thinking of, though, but this is not the, uh, chief's house. Need to go back. Where is... The Chief's house. Is this the Chief's house right here? I think this is. Yeah, Chief's residence. Okay. Now, where's the person that gives me the quest getting bigger? Because I should... I remember seeing it before. Like, I got to it. And uh, it said I was all good to accept it. I just hadn't yet. Where, oh, where... Is the person... I don't know the person's name, either. I should have looked at that when I had the... Web page open. Are they, like, walking up here, maybe? That happens sometimes. Someone who's supposed to give you a quest in a certain area is, like, walking up from the area to the area where they're supposed to spawn at. 